Anne and Concord leave the nightmare realm behind, and together they ride toward the real world. I'm so confused. So if that's the real world, if this is the real world, then how was Anne able to go into the nightmare world, which is not the real world, but she had her real body there with her? I don't understand. They follow the same strange path they took Anne to Pandoria with, and when they get to reach the end, a blinding light greets them. Everything twists and turns like a roller coaster, and when Anne is finally able to see again, she is standing in the stable next to Concord's stall. So do they teleport? Strange camera. I feel so confused. Same, queen. Same. We're not in Pandoria anymore. Concord and I are back in the stable. Hey, where'd you come from? There was a strange light, and then suddenly you're back. I don't really know where I was. It's all so bizarre, but I'll explain later. How's Concord doing? Look, he's moving. You saved him. Well, he's back. I mean, that's good. That's good. That's great. I hope he isn't scarred from the experience. Okay, listen. If I was in that experience, I would be scarred for life. I would need to go get actual treatment. Okay? Like, I already need treatment, but I would need, like more of it, you know? Like, it could be messed up. I'm fine, thanks to you. You were very brave to go into Pandoria to find me. And he can really speak to me. The things that happened in Pandoria weren't just a dream. I know, I'm sure the other girls want to hear what happened. They're outside now, speaking with Derek. Yes, Concord, you want to come with us? I need some rest. Go and speak with your friends. I'll stay here. It's night time. I love how the characters actually move. They don't just, like, you know how in Star Stable you click on a character and then it, like, goes to the next place? Like, I'll go over here, and they don't walk there. They, like, teleport to it. Like, I like how this is actually, like, interactive. Aww. Hi, guys. I'm back, and Concord is okay. He's in the stable resting. Welcome back. It's good to see you again. That's great. We were so worried we were just talking to Derek here and looking at this strange picture of you. I knew there was something special about you, Anne. Just look at this picture. Yeah, I saw that before I went to Pandora, but what is it? Wings and strange auras. Yes, I can't tell you for sure. I need to get back the other photos I took to see if there's something strange about them too. Not only did I lose my photos, I can't even try to retrieve them from the camera because my special batteries got thrown all over the woods. Maybe the goons who attacked you didn't take all your photos. Some of them may still be out there in the woods. They looked like they were after the photos and didn't care about the batteries. What's so special about the batteries? The camera is run on supersonic solar cells, and trust me, we can't find those in Yorvik. It takes a total of 12 batteries, and I have 6 spares. I desperately need 6 more batteries to get this thing running again. Hmm, interesting. Supersonic solar cells. I'm doing some research on them right now. I just need to run in and check something on my notebook, and then I'll try to catch up with you in on Meteor. Okay, I'll bring Concord in case I have to make a quick getaway. Some of the goons may still be out there, lurking in the dark. Bro, Concord needs rest. Concord's traumatized, but okay. Let's find those batteries. Yes, we have to be careful if the goons are still there. They might try to catch us. Isn't that- oh, it's like- it's like a picture. It's not actually Yorvik Stables behind here. Ah, oh, that's weird. Okay. Okay, well, I guess let's go. Let's go. Look, the goons are all over the woods, and they're looking for something. Okay. We, we are not worrying about stars right now. We're getting batteries. I still can't get over how this horse calls Anne Princess. Like, that is so funny. Like, if I was, like, if I was Anne and I got off my horse and he called me Princess, I would, 
literally get a different horse. <laughs> like, that's so cringy. That is so cringy. I guess somebody could say queen or king is cringy, but I feel like that has a different vibe to it. Like, I could excuse that. We need two more batteries. We'll be, we'll be good. We good. We'll be good. He jumps like the reindeer that we have in the game, like this, like the online one we have right now. One more, and we could call it quits and go back to the stable. That's too easy. There's no way. What level is this? I like how when you turn the horse, like, their neck moves with them. I guess we could go onto the road. Oh, is that a battery right there? Okay. Here we go. We have six batteries. Time to return to the stable. This better be easy, because I am not ready for more problems. I have a bad feeling about these- Um, they spotted us. This is Batty Fresh back to the table as fast as we can. Bro, bro, I'm not ready. I'm not ready, I'm not ready. I'm not ready, I'm not ready. Oh my god, oh my god. Oh no. Don't give me anxiety like that. Come on. Oh my god. Bro. Bro. Mm, I'm gonna actually have a panic attack. I can't play games, I swear. This is so infuriating. I'm... I'm... Actually... Really angry. Oh, this fucking horse. I'm gonna buy a new horse. I'm gonna send this horse away and get a new one, I swear. This is so stupid. I'm getting a new horse. Like, dead ass. You're the fastest horse around. Yeah, okay. I'm getting a new one. <laughs> I'm so annoyed. I literally can't play games. Like, this is such a bad idea. I was, like, so excited to be Anne, and now I'm, like, really upset. Like, why does the hottest one have, like, the most issues? He's such a cool- I love the animation, though. He's very cool. Um. Oh. I'm like, where do we go? He's not doing any- do I get off? I'm back, and even though there were some really shady characters out in the forest, I managed to get the batteries you needed. Okay, I could retrieve some pictures, but the camera is damaged and may have a much bigger problem on our hands. Well, I guess I have to explain a little bit about me and why I'm really here. You see, my camera is a very special kind of camera. It could take pictures of things that the eye can't see. Was that why you wanted to take all these photos and had nothing to do for modeling? No, the competition is for real. Let's just say that I have two jobs, one for Glamour number 5 and one for the government. It took a lot of research and some dangerous missions to put this camera together. Thanks, Anne. But how can I trust you, Derek? You can't, but I promise you I'm not one of those bad guys. And I know one thing for sure, there are dark forces at work in Norvik. When I was attacked, the goons stole my backpack, and both you and Concord will be in danger when those evil forces get their hands on the photos I kept in it. What could happen when they get the photos? These photos reveal the very inner essence of you and Concord. They can use them to control you in evil ways. Don't ask me how exactly. All I know is that the people were up against possess almost magical powers, but of dark and evil nature. Hi, it's Linda. Listen, I saw Jessica get into a car with some of the goons, and I heard them talking about going to the abandoned Dark Core platform just off the coast. Thanks, Linda. I'll talk to the others, and we'll decide what to do. And listen to me, we have to take those pictures from Jessica. We must go to the platform immediately. Yes, you're right. We have to stop Jessica from doing any more harm. Let's go, Concord. Good luck. I'm not ready for this. I'm really, really not. 